Hello everyone, welcome to Write to Trick. In this video, I am going to talk about a program, Autotyper. Uh, recently, one of my friends were working on a project of data entry, and you know, in data entry, you use softwares like Notepad RT, where you can't right click for paste, you have to only type. So then she asked me if there is a, uh, any online software which is available for auto typing. But as you already know, all those softwares are trial version or like very costly. So I created this uh, uh, software for her. So let's see. And then I rep uh, uploaded on my GitHub repository so everyone can use. So Autotyper data entry tool is for both Windows and Linux. It works on both. And <coughs> you don't need to have any programming experience for using this program this program is very easy you can uh, use very easily so let's see so this is program you can download from this uh, repository and link will be in description all links so for use this program you have to install python 3 uh, you can e easily install uh, python 3 in uh, your linux and if you are on windows you can download from this file uh, this link you, uh, if you are using 64 uh, bit comp uh, PC, then you can use this file, and if you are on 32, you can use this file. So, after downloading <coughs> Python 3, you have to install uh, PyAuto GUI using this command. And if you are on Linux, then you have to install one extra file, uh, these two extra files, if you are on Debian, and if you are on Arc Linux, then you have to need only this one file. And if you are on, <coughs> on Windows, then you have to only install this file only so let's see how you can use this you can download uh, code <coughs> very easily in linux by cloning into repository but if you are on windows you can direct click download zip file from here and it will be downloaded code download zip so I am running my uh, window on Linux using emulator and I have already downloaded this file. So let's extract this file. <coughs> so these files are extracted. So our main file is autotyper.py. Let's see what this has. Open with any editor like Notepad, WordPad, Sublime, whatever. So I am going to use Notepad. So you don't need to change anything if you want but let's see uh, okay you have to change some things here delay is initial delay like if you choose what you want to print and when you are going to open note priority there will be you need to, to uh, need some time to open that software so you can uh, tell here how much delay you want so uh, let me warn you one thing as you might know that python is very uh, careful about its syntax so don't remove any spaces like if you remove this it, this will not work so <coughs> this is only initial delay and you can also see in my repository here parameters which you can change delay initial delay so that you can open file where you want to write and name full path of input file so uh, like if you want to uh, let's see let's create a file here which you want to be typed name it file.txt you can copy paste paste in this file here very easily from uh, anywhere so this is a test file which will be auto type so we created this file saved and as you can see this is uh, stored here so copy this address and if you are on windows you have to choose, choose this remove hash and you have to disable this because this is for linux and this is for windows so i disabled this linux uh, line and enabled this windows line so i am going to replace this with the path of the file where file is stored file is stored in c users bob desktop auto uh, that 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 and file.txt that file.txt was the file of name so save this file and interval this is important let's see 
name full path of input file you have to only change three parameters first delay how much delay you want name path of file which you want to be printed and this interval because some softwares like uh, notepad rt will know that you are using any software if you keep speed very very high so you can change according to you uh, i initially choose 0 0.07 0 0.07 seconds i will change this parameter and show you what happens when you change so i sh shaved this file so now if i open where i want to type like this is notepad rt which doesn't allow pasting so open this file open auto typer okay something is wrong okay uh, how you can run this file right click with shift press shift in your keyboard shift and right click and you will see option open power shell window here so this is my cell here just a sec I think I miss type something here so for run a python program you have to type python ok python and program name of program which is autotyper.py oh, sorry auto typer.py and press enter ok no module named pyautogui so I have to install this so for install pyautogui first of all let's zoom this this is not clear uh, where is pyautogui I thought I already installed that but it didn't pp install pyautogui let's see if I am connected to my internet connecting pyautogui ok I am connecting that's fine good so you will see that error if you didn't install pyautogui so first install python 3 and then install pyautogui and then we are going to run program using simple python autotyper.py so let's it is taking some time so it is installed if you want to uh, clear your screen you can type clear ok so let me size, resize this again so our requirements are met let's run, try to run this program again <laughs> hopefully this will work this time ok this is running open this file and let's see if after 10 seconds this will st start to type or not and uh, you know in python if you want to uh, exit a program you have to press ctrl c at that program so ctrl c program is existed and you know this is auto typing so let's try to change its speed uh, let's say 0 0.1 second what happened now ok I am also going to increase delay because this is very higher right now 5 second so first of all I am removing this and let's try to run our program again you can uh, run previous command by pressing up key so let's see this will be very fast hopefully it is faster than previous and you are not human typing speed is too high that's why I use that uh, speed because software will block high speeds so let me show you on Linux again uh, like this was file so first of all let me uh, make a content which we are going to this is auto typed content and I am going to save this in file.txt ok and this is my current path so first of all I am going to edit this auto typer if you are going to use in Linux uh, first of all I am going to change its delay same as in Windows and as I am using in Linux uh, 
file.txt just a sec okay hopefully this will work because I have a file in txt run using python or to diaper.py and open your software one two three let's see if work or not come on man come on come on was, was there some error there is no error why didn't it work let's see my program again Mm, auto type of file.txt okay oh my god <laughs> that is some delay <laughs> let's run again come on what's happening here okay okay i think i misspelled my path here path of my file so let's run again python autotypo.py hopefully it will work with this time go here we go yeah 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 it's working it's working so let me re re recap again so you download uh, my project from here download zip python from here for windows and after downloading python 3 you have to install this program for windows and for linux you have to install one one more thing using this command for debian and for this arc linux you can change parameters delay using delay delay is initial delay where you can change directory file you can uh, change name of file which you want to be printed you can create any .txt file and file will program will read from that you can uh, change interval how fast you want to be typed and make sure you didn't make it too fast otherwise program will tell that you are a robot you can easily run program using python auto.py so that's all for this program if you have any trouble you can send me an email or something like that so if you like my pro uh, this software you can give me thumbs up subscribe my channel and if you want to support my work you can uh, buy me a coffee using this link links all links also available in description thanks for watching video that's all thank you very much